Hello, I'm Ethan Burks. Hoosiers with private insurance plans pay more for hospital care than residents in 44 other states. A new study released today by the RAND Corporation says patients with private plans pay three times more than fellow Hoosiers on Medicaid. It is really the way, again, that these large insurers have negotiated on behalf of employers. The findings show how hospitals rely on private payers to keep health systems running at a profit. Healthcare providers say Medicaid and other government programs reimburse hospitals at rates lower than what it costs to deliver the services. The Bloomington City Council defeated a quarter percent local income tax increase that was aimed at funding new economic, social justice, and climate change efforts. So I was disappointed in that vote. Uh, I was encouraged that the council members overall were very supportive of those kinds of directions, and we'll keep working on that. Hamilton says there will still be opportunities to appropriate funds toward these areas in the upcoming 2021 budget. The council will vote on the final budget October 14th. And Indiana's food banks are in critical need of volunteers. The Indiana National Guard deployed members to the state's 13 regional charitable food distribution sites at the beginning of the COVID-19 pandemic, but their temporary six-month deployment ends September 30th, leaving these food banks with a huge gap in their workforce needs. Hoosiers interested in volunteering can sign up at operationfood.in.gov while they'll be matched with a local food bank in their area. And checking on the weather tonight, we're looking at a cooler temperature of 44 degrees as the low, clear skies. And then we see the sun come out Saturday and Sunday for the weekend and stay there for next week as temperatures will stay in the mid-70s. For more news, be sure to go online to our website at WTIUnews.org. Have a good weekend, everyone.